Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Chef Mike and today I'm gonna teach you how you can cook Michelin star level dish on the budget and even at home. I'm gonna use this super tasty but cheap cut of meat. So take a seat and let's start it. First thing we have to do is to put sweet potatoes on baking tray and inside the oven 200 degrees Celsius until they are soft inside. Then I cut my kohlrabi for my garnish. You can cut any shape you like. I'm gonna use large buttons today. So first I cut thick slice and from there nice batonne. Now I'm gonna steam them until they are half soft. It takes around 30 minutes, depend of your steamer. Now it's time to make my applesauce. I start with sugar on the pan and make brown caramel. Then I put apple vinegar inside and reduce it a little bit. Now it's time for some apple juice and reduce it again. You can put salt and pepper in this stage as well. Last thing is coming my chicken stock inside and reduce it again. Now I got nice apple sauce. And if you use strong wheel stock or something like this, you can use it how is it. But because I use chicken stock without my gelatin, I put also some butter in to thicken it up a little bit more. And my apple sauce is done. In this time, my sweet potatoes are cooked. It took around one hour. Now I scrape the middle out and pass it through the chinois. Inside is still a lot of water, what I don't want to, so I will cook it on low heat for a few more minutes. And if you first time here, click the subscribe button down below, so you're never gonna miss any of my new video because on this channel, I'm gonna teach you every week how to cook like a pro at home. And now I put some butter and mix it properly. You're gonna need some milk as well to help the mash don't split. I season it with salt, pepper and ground coriander, mix it properly and my sweet potato mash is ready.
But now, let's cook king of the show. I'm gonna season it properly with salt and pepper. I like to season chopping board and then roll the steak around so the seasoning is everywhere, even on the sides. Pork neck is a very cheap cut of meat. I did pay less than two dollars for that, but the taste is amazing. I'm gonna use cast iron pan so I can get nice crust around. Start with vegetable oil and put my steak on very hot pan. This is what you wanna see. Now I put some garlic and thyme to give even more flavor and put inside the oven around 180 degrees Celsius. For you who are not sure about timing, I always recommend meat thermometer like I was using in the duck recipe. With that, you can set up your final temperature and the app calculate exact time inside the oven. I'm gonna leave link for him in description down below so you can check it out. But now my kohlrabi is cooked so I'm gonna roast it a little bit. Steak is ready as well, so I'm gonna take it out of the oven and leave it to rest. I give color on one side of the kohlrabi, then turn it around, put some butter, salt, pepper and ground coriander and I'm gonna glaze it with the melted tasty butter. And if you like to use recipe guys, don't forget to give it thumbs up and if you wanna really learn how to cook like a pro and not just watching videos, I'm doing personal online cooking coaching and consulting. You can book our first discovery session with me in the link below and I'm looking forward to see you there. And my kohlrabi is done. Last thing I will prep few Brussels sprout leaves. I separate them nicely and then I steam them for around one minute just before plating. Now I just cut my meat and I'm ready to finish the dish. I start with my roasted pork neck with garlic and thyme, few nice kernels of sweet potato mash and if you wanna learn how to do them I make a quick tutorial on my Patreon page so you can check it out. My kohlrabi with ground coriander. some steamed Brussels sprout few carrot tops and finish it with sweet and sour applesauce. Enjoy guys! I hope you liked this recipe guys. If you learned something new, give it thumbs up. If you wanna see more of my work or get personal cooking coaching from me, 
I got all the links in the description down below so you can check it out. And if you first time here, hit the subscribe button so you're never gonna miss any of my new video because on this channel I'm gonna teach you every week how to cook like a pro. Thank you for watching and I see you soon.